Good day, my wonderful people. Welcome back to this channel. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on the time and where you're listening to this news from. This is Afri's Concept TV. Breaking news. Fresh crisis rocks Labour Party. Peter will be attacked for congratulating Tinumbu. News in details. Aki Olaya is turned supporter of Peter Obi and member of the Labour Party has faced criticism from the obedience movement for congratulating President Bola Metinumbu following the Supreme Court verdicts. Olaya took to Twitter to address his fellow obedience, urging them to remain resolute and plan for the next election. Despite the court ruling in favor of Bola Metinumbu, however, some supporters questioned Olaya's Olay motive, suggesting that he congratulated Tinumbu due to their shared ethnic background. One supporter using the undo, the undo, Mr. Truth, insinuated that Olaya had prepared the congratulatory tweets in advance, implying a close relationship between him and Tinubu due to their Southwest origins. Another comrade, comrade, believed that Olaya should not have intended to congratulate President Tinubu, urging that refraining from doing so did not even take him impolite. This comrade emphasized the importance of standing firm in one's beliefs and principles. Similarly, Emekene criticized Olaya for including the congratulatory message describing it as an unnecessary addition that tainted an otherwise well-written piece. Johnson, another obedience, expressed his refusal to accept Tinubu as its president and expressed disappointment in Olaya for moving on so quickly. He lamented that the lack of willingness to make sacrifices for the country and occasionally regretted being born in Nigeria. Reno Mokri, a prominent member of the People's Democratic Party PDP, also commented on the situation, stating that the claims that by that's made by some of the Peter Obi supporters that Tinubu was not their president amounted to treason. A mockery statement came in response to supporters such as Aisha Yusuf and also Adichie Chidima, who considered Peter Obi as their president despite the court's ruling. It is evident that the Supreme Court's verdict has caused division with Peter Obi's camp, with Akinlaya facing black clash for congratulating President Bola Metinumbu. The reactions from fellow obedients ranged from questioning his motives to express disappointment and disagreement. Despite this, despite these differences of opinion, it is clear that the political landscape remains highly charged and contentious. Thank you viewers for listening to this news. Wow. Um I think the supporter, Labour Party supporters are very much right. That means it's even expecting Tinubu to become the president. For what I've just I've just been said now, it was confirmed that the congratulatory letter has been written before now. Meaning that he has been expecting Tinubu to win the election so that the congratulatory message was given to Bola Metinubu, which is very, very stupid of him. Can you imagine? Anyways, that is all I have to say. 
what is your take on this your comment concerning this news will be very much appreciated please don't hesitate to drop them below the comment box click on the subscription button as well as the bell button to receive notifications each time